Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Woke, and I'm here with my brother, Nux. Hello. And we're here for the finals of the Nero Fest, uh, aka the original Nero Fest, <laughs> as we go into and fight the Ultra Difficulty, the original version. My brother looked it up, it looks like this version, if we had killed Nero, it would have given them a one-time Guts. But this is the version that has either 10 times they have Guts, or it's unlimited. Yup, it's, it's a 50-50 on which one it is so let's go into it so starting first it's your turn uh no i picked oh yeah i, I guess picked... i think again we have to probably start castoria again to be honest you think? like uh, she's just the the best one that we've got here we actually do have a merlin here we can definitely use is it merlin. time for merlin to shine it might be time for merlin to shine show him why he's the reason why they got him rid of him here so let's edit the party now okay um how we feeling about the idea of a berserker sweep? I think this is your time to pick, but also I'll let you think. How do we want to handle this? Because now we know. The starting party is Jack. Jack is going to get hit us with a debuff that makes us so we can't apply buffs. So we need someone that applies buffs, but at the same time we also have to take care of... Uh, I'm the damage dealer though. Yeah, you're the damage dealer, but you have to think about the dudes that we have to take down. Because there's Amakasu in the fight, there's a ruler in the fight. There's this a... is kind of just Berserker beatdown, isn't it? It kind of feels that way, right? Yeah, let's go to Berserkers. Okay. All my Arjuna you have skills. Arju Arjuna, you have Morgan. Um, I think all of Arjuna skills, though, are You have Raikou, up, but I don't think she's ready yet. No, Arjuna Alter I could probably actually level up his skills right now if you wanted to use them. That's the only one I would say. Morgan is ready in terms of a uh, Buster Berserker that can go right now. As much as I love Arjuna Alter, let's go with Morgan. Morgan it is. I if think this will... was back then, I would say probably, I don't know, Erica Black. <laughs> <laughs> yes, actually. Um, We need someone that can heal the team and wipe away that debuff that Jack gives. Uh, we have the, Asclepius. The, we do have Asclepius, but there has to be someone else that we haven't used yet, right? Do we have mm -hmm. something here where it's like buff offense or... There is a remove debuff, I think. Is there? Remove debuff. That's buff. Is it buff status change remove debuff? Yep. Is there like debuff for party or is it... We'll look at it when we get here. Um... It's on NP. You don't have to sort it by just casters. More people have it. Oh, that's true. Bradamante has it? Probably for herself. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> Bless you. Yeah. Bless Sorry, you. excuse me. Um, For a single ally. For rooms. a synchro ally, okay. She has to have it for just herself, right? Uh, Applies a V to all allies. Uh, has to be maybe on her NP. I don't know. Maybe it's I don't know where it comes from her. But let's see where it, maybe it's something on Gene. I'm almost positive I have none of Gene's skills leveled up. Oh no, I do. It's on her NP, I think. Yeah, that's just not gonna be possible unless we give her like a kaleidoscope. Mm. There's Nightingale. Does she give it to all though? Uh, removes one debuff and restores HP for all allies. Hmm. So that's a definite, like, she does. And she does also remove buffs, which is kind of useful. Uh, I'm not sure if she's going to be able to use that skill multiple times, because I'm not sure if she's going to survive seven turns, but it's something to think about for sure. Nice. Uh, Medea Lily, Darius the Third. Jason has yeah for himself I think no wait yeah he does BB has one I know that one was for a single ally yeah it's a single ally we need someone that gives it to all is it really just Asclepius again yeah I guess so <laughs> okay he is very good it's also funny that that one skill the one we're using is the one I have not leveled up at all kinda sucks it's the healing one too yep 
But, you know, I never thought that it would ever come to a time where I would actually use it, because I mostly use them for farming. Alright, boy, your turn to pick. This is a, in case Morgan or someone else falls. Usually, Asaclapius is going to be the next one to fall, so. Hmm. Okay, so we know they got a ruler. We do have someone who is anti-ruler, specifically. I don't know if it's on her, though. She still have anti-ruler? No. Well, it's the other one. Yeah, it's... The, that one's a dangerous one, though. Because <laughs> she'll be up against... She, as a backup, she'll be up against a rider, a saber, and the ruler that we needed gone. Yeah, that's all we're going to assume that Morgan can handle it for the most part. Um, mm. Yeah, Naga Saber. I don't think that's what we do. Hmm. It's in special classes already. Okay. I think Osmandius was more trouble than I thought he would be. A lot of it came down to the fact that he his buff. We need a way to maybe remove buffs or something. And that's what I was thinking, so. It's not gonna be here. It's not gonna be here. I don't think it's gonna be there. There we go. Ugh. Removes buffs. We have Barg, the most mm -hmm. survivor of them all. Yeah, we and she has decently leveled up skills, I can say that much. Jack, mm -hmm. Altera, Terania Kyo. Have you used her at all? <laughs> no, I mean, she's level 5, but she doesn't have any of her skills. Let me see what her skills are. They're all level 1 at the moment. Applies Genin. Increases death resistance. Applies stance grudge. Hmm. So I think on her NP, she gets rid of all buffs. I think we go with Bargus, surprisingly. Bargus? Okay. 10, 10, 8. Not bad. Not bad, Barg. Okay. Next. Then let me see. I think we actually, d I think you're right with the situation here with him, so I think we probably do keep someone here in the back just in case I can take down both Nero and him at the same time, someone who can survive. Unfortunately, Ku is typically that person, but he can't because Nero is a saber. Yep. Does this really activate for every single time that Guts is triggered? Place guts one time, stackable with other guts, increase death resistance, and apply a state where grudge the vengeance ten times. Ten turns is applied to yourself when guts is activated. She'll actually activate that a decent amount of time, but I guess at the same time, it's what does actually that skill give? I think it's if they're Genin. You know, well, it's fine because her first skills make them Genin, Genji. Yeah, and then you NP, and it's like big damage, I think. Did she remove the buffs first? You know what? I'm gonna give her a shot. I'm, I'm gonna put faith in her. I'm gonna put her in. I'm put, put putting her in, Coach. If she makes it this far, I will give her um, the respect and skills upgraded she needs. Yes. If she can pull through in here, I will do it. I will gladly. But give she it has to hit the field. She has to hit the field. <laughs> it's an important first distinction. We had just enough. All right, let's go. The much harder version. Let's see how it goes. I think we should be fine with the first, because the first three are dying to Morgan frame one. And I don't know about uh, the next frame. The next frame is where things actually get kind of difficult. I, think I also realized... up your NP first. Yeah, I don't think she's going to be able to MP turn one, is she? No. Hmm, annoying. I forgot Merlin is uh, not bad, but he doesn't give 50% NP. No, he gives 20 and that's Clapius said. Only gives 10. Okay, so let's start with this move right away. You uh, have it at 10. No, this is the the healing one. Yes. Yeah. No. No, the, the, it's the middle skill you need to get rid of it all. See? Okay. Let's give it her. Oops. Was it the NP charge? 
Was it, did I really just uh, increase MP gain? We didn't get the MP those. gain. Yep, so it was the wrong thing. Remove this one was the first one. Well, that was unfortunate. Um, so she'll be at 40. And then if you give the 10 from the skill command code, be 50. Would be enough to just immediately deal with this and not worry about it. And yes. then we can see if... Okay, I think that's what we do. Do some more HP. There we go. Okay. We'll go. Do we want to try and farm some arts um, with, with them? Yeah, yeah, Merlin and uh, Asclepius before we just completely destroy with Morgan? Yep. Okay. That's a good idea. Those are NPs are pretty dang good. They are if we can actually reach them. So it'd be nice if we can get try and get some right now. See how much a roadless Camelot will do. MP level one. I think this is enough to this kill the entire team. This actually will demolish Lancer. I was real close. Well, at least you they didn't get the important buffs. No. Oh, thank god she wasted on the mana burst. That's kind of annoying, but it's fine. Ooh, shit, she really dealt a fuck ton of damage. Yeah, mana burst does a lot. Now that's bad. Get hungry. Yeah, okay. Um, we we can protect this, this turn. With Merlin. How much is this on a turn down cooldown? It's of seven, and to be honest... Uh, as a, uh, Amakasu is actually just gonna completely destroy us if we're not careful. Yes. And it doesn't matter because he's gonna be able to, okay. So we actually don't want to deal with her yet because she gives NP2. Yes. So, so we just farm NP off of Amakasu. Do you want to go here, 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 or do we want to really just wait? Because we can kill her now, and then the next person that comes in is gonna be Ozzy? Yeah. And then we try and kill Ozzy, them, and all in one hit. And hopefully it's just Nero by the end. Yeah. The only issue being, I'm not sure if his defense... Uh, okay, you know what? We're going to try it. Am I targeting her? Okay, yes. We'll go here. We basically... Our time limit is whenever Amakasu does his NP, because that's going to be what destroys everything. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Ouch. That kind of hurts. Is he just gonna constantly make us go hungry? Yeah. Imperial privilege plus the def defense. Yeah, and this lasts three turns. Five. Five turns. I did not know it was that good of a skill. Yes. Uh, do we want to heal for now? Yeah, we can. I'm not sure if Morgan, regardless, is gonna be able. Is does her guts stack? Didn't no, say it can, but we can still apply it. It's for three turns. It is. Do we want to attempt to get a Mer Morgan? Yeah, and just shuffle the cards. Let's try it. That was actively the same. No, it's actually worse. Yeah. Uh, do we? Okay, I think we go here and then try and deal some damage. Just in case things go bad. You got a crit. Well, it's a nice crit. Mana burst is fine. Charge gain is very bad for us. That was also very bad for us. She's gonna die from the poison? No, she's not. Okay. So we can activate this. And then activate this. That will give her a debuff chance down. Okay, so. Artoria is oh, gonna kill it. She's gonna also NP, so I think we have to actually hit her right now. And if Osmandius buffs her NP, yeah, that means Amakasu is going too. Okay, so we go Morgan, Merlin, and then Morgan? Yeah, probably. Okay. Hope to god that she deals 56,000 in one crit. Oh, that's not enough. It's because of the defense up. Yeah, it's not enough. It's not enough, Chief. This is where everything dies. Her guts activates, but it's not gonna matter if she gets hit. They got NP gain down. I mean, they're all alive. Oh, you've got to be shitting me. 
Yep. He literally activated the worst possible skill he could have activated. Because now everyone just dies. Yeah, it doesn't matter if they had any buffs at all, they're gone. Yep. Oh my god, I fucking hate Amakasu so much. Such a piece of shit unit. And she's getting all her HP pack, too. Well... And Ozabendius is about to kill whoever, so... Not yet. Not yet. Okay, so we have some time. We have to work again on trying to... Wait a minute! She actually has a bonus against him. Yeah, she's an Avenger. Okay. Uh, do we have anything to really spare here? I'm not sure what these skills do, so maybe... You know what? I'm gonna just risk it for the biscuit here. Well, he's getting to whoever she attacks. Let's hope she can get her MP. First all enemies. And then this one, I think we have to save. It's the stackable guts, yeah. Yeah, with this one we can save for now. Uh... <laughs> Sorry. One of... Uh, this one increases... No, that's for her... If sunlight's up. Nope, this is the one I'm thinking of. This is the defensive skill. Yeah. Okay. Alright, it's not bad. Uh, you can do a full Ushi on her. Yeah, which is what I plan to do right now. Okay. See what this does. Probably not enough, but you know what? I'll take the type effective damage at 100%. That's fine. 50. NPE. It's not bad. Get hungry. Got this stupid get hungry okay, she's about to MP probably guard and put the invincibility on her for a defensive turn. Yeah. Okay, and then I think we just kill her off of Barg now. Yeah. And then we'll go do do arts. You can do mash or her. Oh I could I could have done it, but I wanted to get her. Uh, it was really close though. We kill it next turn. It's fine. Here comes Ramses. His five turns of big defense should be over soon, right? Hopefully. Think we sealed the defense down. So it's good that we didn't attack him there. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. I should have also used her skills. I should have realized that, but... Okay, she has her NP now. She does. So we could attack... Uh, Mr. Man. But it would put Nero at front. I think we have to take care of the back part. And yeah, I'm guaranteeing, guaranteeing the kill now. Going here and then here. So we can do a little bit to Amakasu in the front. He'd be on dead. Yeah. And then next we have no choice but to hit Amakasu with the MP and kill him. No, because he's about to, like, NP. No, but not now. He's not going to do it this turn. They can only attack three times. Thankfully. <laughs> okay. Go here, and then... Sadly, there is nothing. She has nothing now. Um... And he's not getting. We have literally nothing. Yes. <laughs> Bless you. This is where it all ends. Do we just have to hope that the 10% hits? And that 80,000 is enough for a single target NP with 100% up? Let's hope. If anything else, she's surviving this because she has multiple stacks of guts. But she's also going to lose them if Amakasu hits, actually. Oh, uh, that's the dude. They, I think they killed him. <laughs> oh, thank god. I was going to be like, that was a lot of damage. I don't know how many things were on there. Oh, oh, yeah, I forgot. Bard removes boss with her attacks now. Okay. That's kind of bad, but we need to somehow kill him. We sure do, and we don't really have good ways to kill him right now. So he's going to attack someone, and he's going to hit him. We have to hope that he hits the right person, the person with the stackable guts. Yes. Yeah, that we actually want to see die, yeah. And then we have to deal with Nero. Yes. Uh, go here, here, and here, and hope for the best. I think that's really all we have. 
Mm. That's not going to be much. And she missed the 50. Mm, of course. And we just have to hope that he hits the right person. The one in the middle. We'll see. Yeah, he hits Vargas. the absolute worst person to hit. Because our MT is now sealed. And, oh, I thought she was going to die right there. It would have been. If she's dying here, so it really... She just should have finished the job and put it right there. It's over now. There's nothing we can do. Because also her guts is gone. Because it only. Oh no, it's still there. I mean, she's gonna target all these guts and then I don't know. She's gonna NP and then do her stuff. So I don't it's know. It's all gonna be up to Ushi now. Because Mash is dead, and so is Vargas, and we can't NP with Vargas. Here comes the uh, Saint Claudius. Yeah. And then Guts activates. Guts, Guts. That's the end. Oh, because someone died. Okay, so now we can see what this buff actually does. Increase MP strength for yourself in proportion to the number of grudge adventures you have. It's for 10 turns. So she's just buffed up. Of course it's all mash. <laughs> the, the character I don't want to see any cards from. Because she's dying. Oh, this turn, she dies. There we go. There's well, now, one. actually, it turns out... Okay, no, Mash is dead, and now Ushi what? is dead. Watch this solo. No, I don't she think... Can, she can kill Ozzy on one hit. Can, she is not even going to kill Ozzy on one hit. This is, uh, this is over. This is the fleeting world. I think, honestly, the thing that we messed up in is actually uh, Merlin. Yeah. I think Merlin is actually 100%. If we had just no, used I Castoria. think it's because we uh, messed up on the NP game thing, too. No, if we had just actually gone in a better unit than Merlin, we would have been able to win. Merlin is actually just too bad. That's a lie. He's unfortunately too bad. We don't have double Merlin, so we couldn't win. I do. Well, I don't have double Merlin. I could have used You could have used Waver, like the old days. I could have used Vich. Actually, we could probably just do this again and just try with Vich and see if that works. Okay. Goes Mash. There he goes. There's Ass Clap. I think this is another... Uh, uh, wipe, likely? Yes, that is correct. Yes. There, he there is. you are. I even put Gillis in case. Perfect. 200%. Uh, this should just win. But I think this is another dead run. I think it's, it's literally we have to kill with Morgan or it just doesn't work out. Because there's no way to do it with the backup. Alright, we're back. And this is the official We Give Up team. If this doesn't work out, then... We're switching to Castoria. No, then, <laughs> then we're switching to Castoria. Keep it here. He's also dead this turn. I've seen the future. He's dead. So we may as well get as much damage to Nero as we can. Ouch. Yeah, then this activates and there he goes. This is why level 10 skills matter. This is also why I was grinding Nero Fest to specifically get him to level 10 skills. But it looks like this is uh, the end of this run. Alright, here's the final try. If this just doesn't work, then we just give up. And I'm going to do this off screen with uh, another team build as I try and do it. I'm pretty sure they want you to individually take out dudes. I'm just not into that. We're doing the all three at once strategy and or bust, baby. That's how we're going. We're doing kill or kill. Yes. So now we have double Castoria. We have Summer Kiara. We have two ways to remove buffs in case one of the Castorias dies. Let's go. And we have also um, Kiara's buffs that will last the entire time. We should be able to stall out is what I'm saying. Is that if Ozymandias has his buffs... It's fine, because we can stall them out, and he will die. Yes. That is what we're looking for. Yep. Okay, Who's that. Who's that. And then he's out of here. And then we go for Castoria. And then we go here. Don't use any other skills. Go here. Go here. Go here. Go here, go here, and then 
Doop, doop, doop. I think that it's likely um, Artoria in the back survives this because everyone else, with type advantage, she has been able to live. And honestly, if she doesn't die, that's for the best because that means that we get to not deal with double NP for a while. Let's see, I think they, hopefully they are dead, but no, they all Some survived. of them are. I, why did I hit for Medea? Okay, that was actually a legitimate mistake. <laughs> One moment. This is the for real final team because my brother brought up that the Kiara that I had used was not going to be able to kill. And actually now I'm wondering if we can actually just give her the 200% damage CE herself. So we have two 200% damages as opposed to a t bunch of tiny 100%. No, we don't have enough. No, that's fine. We'll go in. This is fine. Again, they don't want you to kill all of them, so maybe it's better if we just focus in on Jack and then on Mikasu, and then we'll go from there. But she's gonna be completely destroyed by uh, King of Storms over there. There's just no real good way of doing it without just using a Berserker. Out he goes, in comes Castoria. Then make sure she's tapped, meaning she's the one who's being picked. Okay. Hey, we have a full uh, arch chain. Yeah, at least. that's pretty good. We can't use any of her skills right now. Because they are turned, and none of them have buffs. Yeah, because we have to wait for Ozzy, basically. Let's hope this does enough, though. That should be enough to kill Jack. Uh, Medea will likely live this, though. With 100%. And with the, the two eyes they're going to, it should be enough to kill Jack. And then she'll be able to MP again, likely. She'll have a full arch chain. Actually, it might kill both of them. Depending on how much this does. I think it does decent damage, but it's not in no way it's going to be enough to kill completely. Yeah, yeah almost. If she had her invincibility, I would have done it. Maybe, but I'm, I'm, I'm saving it for now. She'll be able to do it on Amakasu this turn. Yeah. That was fine. That's honestly not too bad considering all the shit that we've been dealing with. Yup. Here Amakasu. Okay. Uh, okay, so now do we want to use her shield thing? I don't know, 50% doesn't seem like it'd be a pretty good idea at the moment. No. Uh, uh, we have two busters. We do. So we can probably do en enough damage to hurt him real bad and then get Ozzy out. And then we can debuff Ozzy to get rid of his stuff. Yeah, okay. I think that's the play. You're right. Okay, there we go. And then hopefully this also just kills Medea in the back. Hopefully. Without us ever having to actually do any damage to Medea. Yeah, she's dead. <laughs> yeah, she's dead. Hit him with the hole. The heaven's hole. Amakasu is dead? <laughs> yes. Nega Savior. Is it really that much damage? Yes! Damn. I should have been listening to you from the start. Bing, 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 bing. Bing, 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 bing. So we'll be able to hit him with another NP here then. Let's see. Ow. If we can somehow save her for the end, I think close to the end, because we have to save Nero for the end, that'd be for best, I think. There we go. Here they are. Here he is. But he is they also... don't have the uh, NP two for turn. They um, haven't even gotten it yet. No, they don't have it yet. Artoria Lancer hasn't gone down. Okay, so we need to use. Is it this one? Uh. That's her MP gauge buff, which we don't have to use. It's this one. Yeah. Perfect. Uh, perfect. Let's go here. Do we need to use this? That's why it gives her Fit more strength? MP game and NP strength, but there's no cards for her besides her arts that she's about to do. Yeah, I guess we just save it and just give these to the Castorias. Yeah. Sure. Let's They're pretty see how close. Much this does. I don't think it's going to do a lot, but it's going to do a decent amount. I think Heaven's Hole does a butt ton, so let's see. It's going to be really funny if we beat this first try with Kiara after I was so anti using Kiara. Wow. If you gave him the arts debuff, he would be dead. <laughs> Yeah, honestly, he would be dead. And also, um, if she had the 200%, he'd be dead. Yeah. But also, she'd be dead in the back, which would be kind of bad for us. Okay. There's protection of the sun. Well, 
Oh. We can actually NP with her again. Yeah, we can. I think that's what we're gonna go for here. Is it 50? It's 50. Yeah, okay. it's, it's 50. Again, the Summer Kiara is the better Kiara, but this Kiara has been buffed enough that she's not the same Kiara she was. You can target the, the Lancer or Toria at the back. Oh, I could have, but I don't think it matters because she's dead. Uh, and then I'll use this, and then here. I'm using that for Nero, basically. Okay, and now it's just Nero beat down. Yep. As we slowly wait for, I think, the ability to change teammates comes in, and we tag in someone who deal deals effective damage. But honestly, she should be pretty fine with just fighting her right now, as it stands. Oh, she is. That's why I said you should have aimed for her with the Arts debuff. It would have been. went for Ozzy. I honestly thought that that would have been enough, but no, I was wrong. I've been in the, I've been in the Kiara looping before. Fair enough. That's why I put so much trust in her. <laughs> Fair enough. It's been a long time since I've. I had to use it because I used Summer Kiara for the most part. Okay, so I she's done. I made the change too, to be fair, so I can't blame you. Uh, you can do a full Castoria beat. We can do it for um, how many turns until this comes in? Nine? Okay. We can go here, but she already has full NP. Yeah. As far as I can tell, uh, actually, the middle one could use it. That's so. AoE, so. Mm. Just protect them all. Oh, Nero's not going to be able to do anything, though, this turn, right? No. Yeah, she's got this. Pretty, I'm pretty sure she's got this. Yeah, she's, she's got this. And then Nero doesn't have a way to, um... Gain AP. No. Oh, actually, she does, but not not in this time. No, because Ozzy, Ozzy's down. That was one of the bars. She's, I mean, she still did go for her, which is kind of a, a dick move, in my opinion, but... Well, this sucks. We can stun her. That's about it. Oh, actually, you're right. I think we should go for the stun. Get more NP. Yeah. Uh, I feel weird because this one, she's not going to be gaining any MP, so we may as well just use it now. And we're going to be using it next turn regardless. At least this way, she'll be a actually able to gain NP when the time comes. And plus, this will just soak up the NP that mm -hmm. Nero's going to use. Yeah, eventually when she's out of her whatever moment. Because we use the stun on her. And she also has a lot of defense right now, so we just have to kind of like stall for time. Live through it. Yeah, uh, let's see. Which one of these is likely to die? This one, so we have to use her skills now. No, the one on the right. This one, because it only has one. These two have. Um... No, that one doesn't have one. Oh, did she. Did it literally. The Nega Saver literally lose that turn? Yeah. Oh, that's annoying. Uh, okay. So we kind of got to get him out. <laughs> yeah, okay. I, I have to do it now regardless of anything, but, but I still, I'm still going to use this. And I'll use this just to be sure. Okay. Then the one that doesn't have it is the middle one, so there we go. I forgot that mine has random ascensions on, so that's why I was like, wait, none of them look like... The one you're used to? Yeah. Which is like, all of them? Yeah. I was like, oh yeah, I forgot that I, I have that set on. For the fun and part of it. <laughs> Plus she gets her HP back. Yeah, it's not bad, honestly. We're just lucky that uh, Castoria for double can just really slap, slap dudes around. The only thing she doesn't have is healing. But if she had that, she'd be kind of crazy over the top, and there'd be no reason to ever run anyone else but her. Yup. Because she would have everything at that point. She'd have attack, she'd have defense, she'd have... She has crit stars, right? Mm, I don't think she does. Okay, that's the one thing she doesn't have. Does she? No, she doesn't. Okay. Oh, well, 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 okay. So Merlin has extreme crit stars. He gets extra, extra HP. He has a 20 NP gain, attack up, invincibility, and the buster card. There we go. Which is why he was almost perfect. <laughs> we have to wait for her defense to go down regardless anyway. Because she used Imperial Privilege now. I wish she was attacking Kiara. 
Yeah, it doesn't really do anything, though, to oh. hurt for her. At least we can put down her thing one turn. Heaven's Holer? No, I mean, that gets rid of her buffs so she ever sets up. Yeah, we just gotta wait for her to set up, and we have to, we have five turns until it ends. We, we have the stall right now. Yeah, so we might as well just keep stalling, to be honest. If she's gonna stall us out, we stall her out, and we'll win at the end of the day. Missed both. Nice. Going again? Deal issue. Hit both. Okay, so now I can use this. Yep, there it goes. Uh, do we hit her with the Heaven's Hole right now? I mean, what else are you saving it for? You can wait yeah. for for the switch in for Artoria to do the first skill. Yeah, I think we. The thing I would save it for is for an ad for one additional turn. I think I'm, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to use this, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to do this and hope that Castoria has enough to NP. And then I'll Heaven's Hole into the other NP so that we have two stacks. Okay. Hopefully three if what um if Mash lives, which she will because she has she doesn't have guts, she doesn't live this. It's fine. <laughs> this does get in uh Asclepius. Yeah, which is fine. Well, he actually does have heals, so he can start healing dudes. Uh okay. So yeah, back to what our plan was. Um Okay. Doop doop doop. And now it's just a formality as we slowly- She doesn't also have the heal because Jack's heal can be removed, which is also why they really want you to use the healing ability, the ability to just remove buffs. Mm-hmm. There we go. She's spreading. She's spreading. And then, boom. 25. Again, but I think when Castoria's skills come back, we have the ability to swap into Castoria. Uh, uh, Scortoria. Scortoria is what they call her, but I call her Summer Saber. Yeah, as it should be. <laughs> yeah, I, I think it's a better name. I don't care that there's multiple Summer Sabers and she's not a Saber. I don't care. That's what she there's is to Summer me. There's Summer Saber, there's Maid Saber, mm -hmm. and then there's Kim now... Saber. Caster Saber. Yeah, it was Berserker. Yeah. Castoria Berserker, which they had to put in the official news. That is not her class. That's just what she calls by. It's what her friends call her. Full Asclapius. He says, I'm ready. We can go full Asclapius, actually. It's a heal. So. Might as well. Go. Cook. <laughs> it's really not going to do much, but honestly, it's more than TR could do. Created. Vargas could never. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really pissed at Bark for not doing a single crit. Oh my god, I hate this Imperial privilege. Uh, ow. Yeah, she do be hitting me. Um, you have an invincibility at least. You yeah. can heal too. I can heal now. Okay, I think I'll do that. Um, guess just... Do I activate her invincibility? I don't think there's really a point if I'm not actually attacking with her. We have one more turn until she comes in, so it's fine. I'm just saying because the first skill is useful, that you want to keep her alive. Yeah. It would be nice, but now that I think about it... She gets a guts from me, so... Oh, oh never mind. She missed it. <laughs> he missed? No, she missed. Oh, she, she already has guts. It's not stackable. Yeah. I see what you're saying. Yeah, she's MPing this turn anyway. Uh, hmm. This kind of stinks. It does a little bit of a stink, but I think we just use this for invincibility purposes. And then we that use first her. Skill again? We're first? Yeah. It's a buff blocker. Debuff resistance and increase arc card okay. resistance. So we, we're saving this. Okay. We'll use this to save herself. And as a Clapius, it's okay he, if he you can die. save himself. Potentially. But so then next turn, we go in. That's right, baby. Three arts, Castoria. This is be okay damage, because it's neutral. Yeah. I mean, again, it's it, 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 we're stalling for Goku at this point. We're waiting for Goku. She's the last unit on the team. And I don't want to bring her in into an NP. Because that just seems silly. Not If I had the Castoria NP up, I would. But I don't, so. Thankfully now. Oops. Well, she's a hater. Well, she's a hater. Well, I guess he gets to live with one single HP, because we are bringing him in. Bringing her in. So, go up 
here. Go here. Now we use this. She has some arts to deal with stuff with. Yep, and then we'll go here. Now, this is the where begin. the game begins. This is where the game really begins. This is I the. Forget, is there guts a full HP thing? I thought, I'm pretty sure it is, but it, it, I very rarely ever get to use her guts. And she also doesn't have her guts active at the moment because of the the, the CE. She still hasn't lost the CE. No, I'm talking about Nero. Oh no, I don't think so. It's 25. Pretty sure. I mean, it, 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 this is the original uncut version, so maybe it's going to about to do 50,000 damage. So we'll see. Oh, of course. Oh, there we oh, go. Oh, she's so dumb. Migraine. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, damn. Did I do Struggling. that? Struggling. Sadly, too. Like, it's fine. We're, we're saving that one for potential NP. Okay. Here we go. Let's see how much damage this does, which is gonna be a lot. It's gonna be a decent amount, considering that, yeah, that's an overkill. Let's see if it is actually a full HP. That would be so cruel if it was full HP. Nope. Nope. I think this is the end. Yeah, no, this is the end of Nero. This is like almost two guts. That's two guts. Now she's hating. She's a hater. She is ultimate hater. She now. missed she's the attack. Trying. She missed the attack. And then it doesn't matter because that defense goes away. Bye. Yeah, and then we go here, 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 and that's another life taken. Yeah. Uh, like I said, she's solid for a year one unit. And, uh, like, thank uh, the savior. Who is it, the savior? Uh, Kiara. She really was the MVP of it all. Who I told, I, I kept on telling you, like, she takes out almost all of those units. I, I doubted her. I 100% I, I doubted her, but now I don't doubt her no more. After the experience of, I used so many dudes who would be considered top tier. Arjun Alter, to be fair, didn't have full level 10 skills, so it's not his fault. But so many other units that I would consider super good at you the end of the day. You thought about Kiara. Nope. You thought about better Kiara. That's why these challenge quests, they're, that's what they're here for. They're here to show you the other dudes that you have that you don't use. And they go, use them. For the love of God, use them, and an hour later, this is going to be heavily cut down for the people. This I almost, has to be heavily cut down. I did has no to be. No lore? No lore. <laughs> no lore for this one. They said, whatever, you did this because you're a masochist. Uh, but that's it, everyone. Thank you very much for joining us. Uh, we are not going to be doing these other ones because nope. there's, just, there's just no nope. time. There's, there's two no, more? No. There's two more at the bottom. Are you ready, boys? Sit down for another four hours. <laughs> Sit down for another four hours as we watch King Hassan go through five million Hassans. Yeah, but that's it. Maybe we'll do this for the next challenge quest stuff when we have a little bit more time. But I was so busy with work. But that's it for now, everyone. Thank you very much for watching, especially if you watched all of them. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Say goodbye, boy. Goodbye.